Hey guys, I just wanted to give you a quick reminder. If you're looking for confidence, if you're like, I, you know, I, there's something I want to do, but I'm not, I'm afraid to do it, or I'm, I'm not, I'm not ready to do it yet. One of the things that I see a lot of, uh, a lot of veterinary professionals struggle with is they, they forget that confidence comes from knowledge plus experience and skill. And I, I think a lot of us think that, uh, boy, if I just had the knowledge, if I just knew how to do something, if I knew all about it, I would be confident. And guys, I've just, I haven't found that to be true for most people. I really think, um, I think that it's, I think it's something we hope for because we all, we all are comfortable doing our research and doing our homework and we like to be educated and we should be educated. However, I just, I know so many people who think, boy, if I just, had a degree, if I just had, um, if I just took more classes, if I just keep reading books, then I will be confident and ready to do the thing that I want to do. And guys, I just haven't found that to be true. In fact, there's a terrible habit in our profession of procrastination through knowledge acquisition. And that may sound ridiculous. You're like, you can't, you're not procrastinating if you're learning. At some point you are. At some point we have to put ourselves out there we have to we have to try things. You know, we can't we can't read about hard conversations at some point. We have to be vulnerable and, and have a hard conversation. And um, we can't just keep uh, keep learning about low stress handling. We have to just jump in and get the basics and then start practicing and trying and trying while we're continuing to read. And I just see uh, so many people who, who are afraid to put an ultrasound probe on a patient just, just to look around and, 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 and get some experience because they're like, no, I haven't, I need to take some more courses before I start doing that. And I go, if that's what you want to do, if you're excited about it, if it's not going to hurt anything, if you're, if you're ready, just, just start doing things. And so anyway, I just, uh, I just wanted to remind you that today, if there's something that you you feel like if you had more knowledge, you would have the confidence that you need. I generally don't find this to be true. I think sometimes things are, doing new things are just scary. I think most of us would be better off if we get the knowledge that we need to get started and just get started. And that's how we build skills and experience and knowledge. And that's how we build confidence. And so anyway, guys, uh, I hope this is helpful. Um, I know, I, I look, I think we're all probably looking at something that we're, we're worried about trying. Uh, this is a wake-up call. Um, just do it. Just try it. Put yourself out there. Life is about life is about trying new things, and it's scary every time. But the alternative is more scary. So anyway, guys, take care of yourselves. Bye.